Hey, what's up? Welcome to the channel. And in today's video, we are going to be discussing Sniper Elite 4 and the XP glitch. Um, earlier, I was playing on this map on easy. I switched my difficulty to Authentic Plus because something was working. I wanted to see if it would work at a higher difficulty. And I realized uh, that when I switched back, um, I was getting XP that I shouldn't have got on my save. So the game kind of bugs out. So what you're gonna do, and, I, and I've erased all my manual saves, just to show this from scratch. What you're gonna do is you're gonna start up a game on easy. And when you create the game on easy, what you're gonna do is you're gonna make a manual save. I'll just do it twice just to make sure. And then you are gonna change your difficulty. You're gonna go to authentic plus, start that game. It is going to reset it. As soon as you load into the game, are going to just load your manual save. Now, here you go for your XP. That is the XP that you should not be getting while you're playing on easy. So that is awesome. You will not get uh, the authentic plus achievement for because you cannot have a manual save. Oh man, man! Imagine the time. Okay, so I've realized something else. There are some pretty good maps to do some spawn trapping on, especially if you run around and you collect some of the traps and then you store them. Like, you pick them up and then you, like, hide them someplace. You know, and then you get into them. Um, and speaking of that, the end game map, we should end this, and we'll just get into that tutorial real quick. So we're going to do two videos in one today. Um... So you're going to go to the obliteration and just put it on easy. This game right here, Death with the Storm. amount of stuff that happens at the plan end to game, drop radioactive um, material on this is going to be nuts. The D -Day landings. I might the set up the whole farm on here just to show... ...the spawn trap. But, technically... You've got to kill boss, right? So before you go in there, the game's going to save. So what you would do is you would eliminate everything out here. Get all of the loot and save your, your trap someplace out here. In that process, before you go and start the next point, you're going to create a save point right here. Then you're going to go in and kill boss and create another save point after everything's done in here before you hit that end switch right there to start the uh, the spawn from coming out here. Um, so then you, you would spawn trap the door here, well, the elevator that's downstairs right there and the doorway that's up top. So you would just follow that, uh, that route to that door and then you would just booby trap it. After that's done, you would make another save point and then end your game. Well, not end it, but make a save point, then load up your difficulty on Authentic Plus, and then come, and then blow them doors. Then you're going to get that XP. Then you come running through here, and it's going to set off all the traps that you put in here and out here to kill the wave at the end before you got to make it to the exit that's over here. Wow. That's like 150,000 XP. And the reason why you would have to make two save points is because if you messed up placing traps right here, you could just reload this save, correct that fix, and then you would have to start your game here and then run back in here and then redo the save in there. Because then, when you come running out, you perfect the kills out here. So on Authentic Plus, that's, that's so many explosions going off at once. You're talking 150,000 XP. That's insane. If not more. And you could do that every minute. And then run. So you're talking a million XP in 10 minutes, and that's what you would need to rank up anything after 50. So from 50 all the way up to level 250, you need a million XP. Wow. You could just... Wow. 
All right, well, that's the tutorial. I hope you guys enjoyed. I know it's kind of late. I just realized this by accident because I was experimenting and I wanted to see if something would work. So then I just switched back to my my um my easy mode. Man, the amount of time that I would have saved an authentic plus for the regular achievement would have been crazy if I would have known this too. I would not have had nowhere near as that was amount of kills though. Because I would have did it on easy. Alright, well GG. Have a good one everybody. And I hope you enjoyed.